just before the video starts, make sure you go and check out my website, ystech.org. This is the place where you're going to be finding the latest news and everything great in technology, from reviews to tutorials and much more. So make sure you go check it out in the description, ystech.org. I'll see you there. Hey guys, it is YS from YS Tech here, and today we're going to be taking a look at the Unlink DAC from AliExpress. Now this is a no-name brand from China, and we're going to be taking a look at how it performs, and let's do a little bit of an unboxing today. Now I apologize for the audio quality, if it isn't up to snuff, I have no idea why it sounds like I'm filming this straight off my DSLR. Now I'm going to be trying to do these a lot more often, and uh, let's see how this goes. So, let's open it up. <coughs> no idea what this looks like inside. This comes in a nice box here, as you can see. That. Hope my arm isn't in the way. Um, so, let's open it up here. This comes with a nice... The deck looks pretty good, to be honest. Comes with a... A wall socket, and not for New Zealand. Probably out of focus there. And a um, looks like a jack, like a five volt jack. Have an odd one, but okay, I have a thing for that. You guys can't even see anything. Okay, let me angle this downwards here. This is a bit of an informal review now. <laughs> Okay, so we've got the unlinked deck here. Comes with the deck. Looks good. And uh to test if this actually works. <sighs> so let me just grab my power bank. Now my other deck actually um it didn't work, it's uh not compatible. It's actually not working, so let's hope to god this one works. So it seems to light up there, fine. Um, now, uh, the reason I got this DAC is because uh, it said on the back it actually has an output to audio and it also takes in audio through 3.5 as you can see here. Um, now I believe this DAC was about $30 New Zealand from AliExpress. I'll leave the link in the description below. It looked pretty good to be honest and uh, let's see if it works. What I'm going to be using to test this DAC is a normal 3.5mm cable, my Audio Technica M40Xs, and my Huawei Nova 3i. So let's get this plugged in. I believe the input is right here. And I have to grab a cable for my hand to hook up the back here, like this. Oh, this yeah, takes all that. It's like a mangled mess right now. So let's listen to a song. Um, see if it actually works. So I'm just gonna get my headphones on here, the M40Xs. I'm just gonna put them on, see what it sounds like. Let's listen to a song off YouTube. Hey, this is me from the future. I'm just recording about how I didn't end up finishing how the DAC sounds. Um, now it sounds really, really good. It sounds uh, a little bit flat, but it sounds... Uh, has a little bit of bass and it really kicks out a nice punch to the M40X's. Overall it's great quality especially for the price and if you're looking for a solid deck I'd honestly recommend it. Now let's get back to me in the present time. So it's got three three inputs here as you can see it's got aux, coaxial and um uh what's coax and speedif I believe a toss link. So you get to choose. So this is the switch for it. Just turn it on back in. So aux. It sounds really, really light to be honest. It sounds okay. Um. So that sums up the Unlink DAC review. Make sure to go check out my other videos and check out ystech.org. Make sure you drop a like and comment if you want to see more videos like this. And make sure to have an awesome day. See you guys.